Hello everyone, so today I thought I would do a what we got for Christmas video. <laughs> um, it looks like a lot. Didn't feel like a lot yesterday, it looks like a lot now. Um, there's lots of big boxes, so I kind of have the Scotty side of things, the Scotty slash our household things, and then the teacher slash Sydney side. Um, I'm not going to go through every single thing in detail, but uh, I will show you guys kind of the overview of some of the things that we've got. Um, I know this year has been really hard for everyone and that Christmas may not have been everything that it used to be for you. And so I hope that you were able to have the happiest Christmas you could, no matter what that looks like. I know it's been different all around the world. We were lucky enough to be able to spend a little bit of time with Scott's family in, in different batches. I know that it was definitely a, a smaller scale Christmas than usual, but we enjoyed it nonetheless. And I just wanted to show you guys the stuff. Of course, we're not bragging, just wanted to share some of the things. Let's get started. So this is the Scotty household side. I will start with the biggest bad boy down here, which is a wireless chop saw. Oh, he is so excited for that. He's wanted it for a while now. And I keep saying no because we just we just didn't need it. Scott also got a Milwaukee um, multi-tool. And if you guys have been watching Vlogmas, you have seen that that was actually meant for his dad, but his dad had picked it up unbeknownst to us, so Scotty kept it and we got him a sander instead. And then, just to keep things interesting, we also got a sander, so that's just under here, and it's another Milwaukee cordless sander. Um, Scott, and that's the nice big battery that goes for the chop saw. That was what was wrapped, and then Scott and I went down to the garage to find the big chop saw. So there's often a common trend with Scott's gifts that are barbecue and food related, because Scott likes to cook. I like to eat, so I benefit as well. So his boss got him in Secret Santa. So these are like, kind of like an Uvglove, the not actual brand name Uvglove. And then there's a couple of barbecue sauces and different rubs. The Pez actually came from the stocking his dad made for him. There's a bunch of different things in that. I'm not gonna go through all of it. Then I got Scott a pair of these beer can boxers, because they amused me greatly. Um, my dad got him another vintage ale, we got that last year. This is a power tower instead of a extension cord or power bar. Um, it's a vertical tower which is very helpful for Scott's desk area. I got him some reading socks, he got these LED smart um, light strips. We have a chicken roaster, we have a meat tenderizer which he is beyond thrilled to try. Um, and then he also got some beers, these are from um, Five Paddles Brewing Co., which I believe is an Ajax. Um, he also got some barbecue rubs. We got some serving spoons because you can never have enough of those. This is also from the stocking. His dad's stocking some Soda Stream flavors. Uh, we've got a decanter, and actually, it's more of an aerator, um, right for the glass from the bottle. He got some hot sauce. That was from that was actually a trade after our uh, gift steal. Um, Toblerone, there's a pancake, gourmet pancake maker, and then there is a barbecue tray. Uh, one of the games our friends got us is overrated, and I hadn't heard of this one before. It actually looks kind of amusing, and it's from the people who made What Do You Meme? Then in this stocking from one of his aunts, there's a lot of um, like water enhancers, so whether it's like an orange or lemon, there's some of the crush water enhancers. And then one of the treats for me in here was actually a self-tanning foam from Bondi Sand. I've never tried this one, but I'm excited. And then I also got Scott. This is kind of like his big gift from me, which you can't really see because of the light and because they're black. There you go. So I got him some black Tims, which unfortunately are a bit big. He likes big shoes, but they're actually a little bit too big, so unfortunately they're kind of sold out on the size that he wants, so we're going to figure that one out. Now on this side, something that's not pictured are all the lovely gift cards that my students gave me this year. I got Amazon gift cards, I got LCBO gift card, I've got a HomeSense gift card, Starbucks gift cards galore. Definitely will not be paying for Starbucks for yet another year, <laughs> but um, grateful for that. A couple gifts here that were like handover gifts. So there is this set right here, which is a travel mug and a water bottle set. They both say both best teacher in the world. And it did actually come with the Keep Calm Carry On Tea tin with um, afternoon tea in it. I forgot to grab that from the cupboard. I've been loving it. Then I got a lint 
Praline Classic um, set. Delightful. Favorite ones hands down. Never had them. We've only ever purchased those from now on. And one of the other things that I got from my students was this gorgeous hurricane lantern. And inside it there's some reading socks, there's an LCBO gift card, some chocolates, and this really cute snowman cookie. Um, other things here, so this is from my dad to Scott and I, and the funniest thing is this is something I was actually going to buy Scott this year. And then unfortunately, read too many kind of like negative reviews, not of this particular model, but of all the other ones I was looking at, so I kind of chickened out and didn't get it, so I think it's hilarious that he ended up getting it for us, so thrilled. Um, I also got a kettlebell, it's obviously for Scott and I, but I'm the one who really has wanted it. I got some reading socks with cute little walruses on them. Then under here is another gift from one of my students. So this came with the tea set. These came from Scott's dad's stocking. There's a scarf and a couple of skincare products in there from one of my students, which is lovely. Then in this bag, I have some stamping metallic polishes. I think there's six of them and some stamping plates. And that was my Secret Santa gift. Um, over here, another couple things. So. The fabric markers were another uh, fun gift from Rob um, for this Christmas. We have a wine stopper. I got some Lindor chocolates from my stocking. Um, from the Santa Steel, I got this ginormous hot and cold water bottle. It's like a liter and a half, so just think how much tea can fit in that. Thrilled looking forward to it. <laughs> um, I got my own little cast iron cookie. So mine has M&Ms in it. My dad picked up this beer for me, not because it's a beer that I would like, but because, you know, it has an attempt of my spelling. So that was kind of cool. So Sydney Street Oatmeal Stout. Oh, another gift from one of my students was a Mario Badescu skincare set. Thrilled for that. Um, I have a port back here, and I have a rosé. I have some hot chocolate mixes. Super excited for that. Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer was in one of the um, stockings as well. I've got some Harry Potter playing cards. I have a face mask. I have a gift pack for the lottery scratch tickets my dad always gets me. This is a silk pillowcase. I have a Brie Baker for my dad. He actually bought me a Brie as well, but it's in the fridge. Um, Scott got a wine decanter for us because we have been drinking more wine when we have guests over. So I figured if we're going to have red more, we should have a decanter. So I thought it was really funny that my dad also got the small decanter for us. Um, I got a puzzle. So I have a Thomas Kincaid DC women puzzle. So the villains and the heroes. So that was really cool. There's an Elizabeth Arden gift box down here, which you'll see up on the blog soon. For giggles, Scott loves Breathwiser things. He used to have one, and so he decided let's have another one just because. Um, I also got a Kitten Ace bodysuit with a really nice square neckline. Love that. I got the Ichabog. I got some popcorn to go in the popcorn machine. And then my biggest gift from Scott is the Theragun Mini. So his mom's had the Theragun for several years now, and it's amazing. It's just amazing. I can't even go on. So when, when you're super stiff from working out or it's really sore, um, it can really, really help. And I'll show you guys a picture of it later. But this is one of the newest ones, and it's the mini, and it's smaller, and it's quieter. And I am absolutely thrilled to bits to have it. I've already used it. Last but not least was a gift from my dad to continue our home theater experience. He has two more speakers to add to our collection for more surround sound. That is the spread this year. And again, I am super grateful to everyone who's gotten us things. We will get some solid use out of all of these things and I will see you guys in my next video and if you haven't already please check out the last vlogmas installment it was kind of the week leading up to Christmas and a little bit of Christmas Eve and Christmas Day so I will see you guys in my next video don't forget like comment subscribe hit that notification bell and I'll see you soon see ya so it's Christmas dinner we have everyone gathered around so cheers to you and yours and I wish you guys a Merry Christmas